The first book in the series, the Gray Man series, was optioned as a film, and it's coming out on Netflix this year. Tell us a little bit about that. Yeah, they filmed it last year um, in Los Angeles, as well as in outside of Paris and in Prague. And it's uh, going to be a, a Netflix film. They're they're saying probably July it will be out. Great. And they had a two hundred million dollar budget. It, so far, it's uh, Netflix's largest uh, budget for any film they've ever made. So uh, I'm excited to see it for sure. Did you have input with the writer of the screenplay? Yes, uh, it, the screenwriter was Joe Russo, who's one of the Russo brothers, and they're the directors of it. And they did all the art, the Marvel movies, Endgame, Infinity War, and Captain America. And um, Joe and Anthony Russo had me come out to California while they were working on the screenplay and spend a few days with them, trying kind of to get my thoughts about, you know, what they were doing, but also in a larger sense about the series and where the series goes after book one. And then when they started the film, they sent me the shooting script so I could see, you know, what they actually settled. I'd, I'd read uh, an original script that Joe had written uh, a few years ago and I hadn't seen anything else since. So um, they had a couple other screenwriters come in and they sent me that shooting script. And uh, I, it was terrific. I was I was excited. I, I was more than assured because Joe's original screenplay was so good. You know, I knew they were on the right track. I knew it would be terrific, but the, the one they actually shot was fantastic. Did they change anything from the book? That's oh, absolutely. Cool. Yeah, yeah, I mean, absolutely. And, and I, you know, you have to. And, some people's philosophy is the the book should the film should absolutely mirror the book. A, I think that's pretty much impossible in most you know cases. Right. And B, you know the way I look at it is I'm a creative person and I'm and I'm an artist and uh, these directors are artists and these um, cinematographers are artists and and all that stuff. So, sorry. Um, so I think that. The way I look at it is that everybody's putting their creative spin on my original <laughs> idea. And as long as it doesn't go so far afield, I think it's a good thing. There's things in the script that actually take place in other Gray Man novels. Um, and I thought that was interesting. So it's it, it's all about book one, the Gray Man, but it introduces some characters because their hope is to turn this into a franchise. 